All right, we're going to convert this OBD1 Honda ECU to from auto to manual. So I'll show you what we got. The 37820 number, the first one there, that's a number given to all American made uh, for American cars. P28, uh, from what I know, is single cam and uh, P75 should be all uh, B series. I know like LSs and stuff. And then these numbers start meaning something else. I think A and then the second one here, 5. So 0 through 4 should be manual. And then 5 through 9, I think, are man uh, automatic, rather. But we're going to convert it. First thing, start removing all these screws. Tray. I don't have my tripod, so I'm working one handed today. one so that just makes the process that much faster okay what are we looking for here this is what we got in the inside let me get some light rp18 and we're looking for rp17 that should be next to it all right yep it's marked, so it kind of skipped. So you can see that is 18, and then that one's 17. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut those out of there. A pair of uh, flush cut pliers. These are a uh, Mako, but I mean you can probably do it with anything else. And a little bigger one, not the small one. So we're gonna cut that out of there, and or you could de uh, take a soldering iron and then. Uh, just burn it out of there, but you want to take both of them out. Alright, uh, so far, 17, I cut it, I just cut it out of there. You can see it right there, just a little resistor. Uh, we don't need that anymore. Uh, you would have had to, if you desoldered 17, you would have had to fill it in with some solder to fill in the holes. So what we're going to do is we're going to take... soldering iron and try to desolder it. So I might have to work it from the back side and uh, just to get it out of there because we got to clear out the solder out of there so we could uh, put a piece of wire in there. Okay so this is what I came up with. Uh, I recommend you buy the real tool to push these uh, connectors through and just to clean up the opening. Uh, it's a pain in the ass to just do it with just a soldering iron. But I clipped RP RP17 because you have to fill it anyway, so I just clipped them out of there. Um, then I made a hole. But I mean, you could just solder it to whatever's left there. But I, I tried cleaning it up and I took a piece of. Uh, I had a bigger resistor in a pack of them. But I cut the one leg off it. You just want to use this metal piece here. Uh, I actually used this end of it once I heated it up with the soldering iron to push through just to clean up that. But I mean, you could probably use like a thumbtack or something like that. But there's a real tool to do it. So once you shove that through there, what you're going to want to do is throw a little bit of solder on there. I'm not the best at this, it's a pain in the ass. There you go. And then you're going to want to clip that leg of it off. That's the side that stuck in first, so it stuck out a little bit further. The other one just stuck out just a little bit, and then I just clipped clipped it. So what I'm going to do is clean some of that off of there, clip that end, seal this thing, 
and it'll be ready for a manual transmission. But these come in handy. They're just uh, flush cut pliers. You need a soldering iron, screwdriver, or something like that. A little bit of solder. Get the thinnest stuff possible. The fat stuff doesn't really like the spread on there. Uh, you can use a piece of, I guess you can use wire, but the best is to use like an old resistor or something like that. And I used a little drill bit, but it didn't really work. I tried using that to push it through. But, see that? I'll probably save that just so I can use the other end of it for something one day. But, you get a bag of resistors. I have these from diff different projects. These are another one. Some of these are, uh, those are diodes. These are resistors. Um, but I have plenty of stuff from just little projects. I mean, you can get those cheap enough. And, uh, just gonna reseal this case. And it's converted. It's converted, uh, VTEC to, from auto to manual transmission.